Hey, speaking of other things trending on social media, this had a lot of our viewers talking yesterday. A Minnesota family's dream vacation to Costa Rica pretty much ruined because a little boy on that family trip broke his femur. Yeah, not wow. something you want to run into. They are now stuck there for weeks on end. Here's their story. It was a planned two-week dream vacation to Costa Rica for Emmy Lopez and her family. I've told my husband for five years that I wanted to go. Um, had not worked out, so we finally have saved up and planned for this trip. She, her husband, and two sons arrived at the tropical destination last Tuesday, and come Wednesday, everything took a turn for the worse. He was holding his leg, and he just said, owie, 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 he wouldn't talk, and he was shaking and shaking. Lopez's three-year-old son, Axel, had fallen and broken his leg. He was rushed to the hospital, where the family waited six hours for an operation. These doctors that are asking me, what do you want to do? Um, and I specifically asked, I said, will he be able to travel with this cast? Yep, no problem, no problem. But there is a problem. Axel is unable to travel for six to eight weeks. All he can do is lie flat for 24 hours a day. Unable to fly a commercial airline, Lopez said she called the U.S. Embassy. They suggested an air ambulance to fly Axel home, which is around $42,000. Unfortunately, their insurance company not going to cover the costs. As a mom, it's been really hard because my kids are my everything. Could you imagine that no. is just a nightmare for families because I of can't. course it's another added cost. Now we shared this story yesterday and a lot of comments already pouring in. You can see them now scrolling at the bottom of your screen. So the big question, what's next for the Lopez family? Well, they're waiting it out. Fortunately, they're staying with the host family that they met so 10 years lucky. ago when they first went to Costa Rica. But of course, they're not going to work. The bills are piling up. They had to pay for that emergency surgery and they're stuck there now. So they do have a GoFundMe page, hoping to bring Axel home soon. And we have a link to that GoFundMe page at carolevin.com. So far, I think they've raised about $17,000. Wow, people stepped up. It really makes you think twice about the precautions you take when you travel, especially with children.